doing Clinton Diaz here it's another fantasy Premier League video today I'm gonna show you my team my overall transfers I'm gonna show you like the budget how you get how to get the how to budget your defenders midfielders etc goalkeepers all of that I'm gonna show you all of that in a second so first of all let me show you my team let's progress to my team you can see we have Pickford as the keeper for against Wolves. I put Pickford in because he's a cheap keeper and playing against Wolves. And as you can see, we go down here. Everton's fixtures aren't that bad. We play Wolves first, then they play uh, Southampton, then they play Bournemouth, then they play uh, who's next? Um, oh yeah, here we go. Everton against Huddersfield. So they have good matches. I was like, why not pick for them? A really good keeper like David De Gea on the bench. Then go to the defenders for Van Tongen, Duffy and Robertson. You guys must be wondering, why the hell you got Duffy there anyway? Because I had no money at all, like, just put Duffy in because I was broke. I was like, I didn't, I didn't just put anything in there. But guys, just saying, this is not my final team. Um... I don't know how it looks because I have Duffy, then I have Lingard, then I have Calvin Lewin, then I have Zaha. Like, like this is not the best team, so. Um, but other than Pickford and De Gea, I'm keeping those guys. And Robertson, because Robertson is a really good uh, left uh, left back for Liverpool and he can get assists, maybe even a goal. So, guys, I'll be back in a sec with my final team and like my final proper team and explain all the budget. How to, how to budget on defenders, how to budget on goalkeepers, how to budget on midfielders, and how to budget on strikers. I'll be back in just a sec. Guys, I finally finished my team. Guys, I finally finished my team. I can tell you it's a really hard process to to finally make your team. It's really hard, like, it took me like around half an hour. <laughs> but anyway, this is my final team. You've got Pickford, you've got Van Tongan, you've got Duffy, you've got Robertson, you've got Ozil, Eriksson, Salah, Shakiri. For Depoche, Wilson, and Aubameyang. I've got my bench, Cedric, Oriol Romero, Maloney, and Hammer. My other goalkeeper, I probably will never use him. So, yeah, this is my team. Comment below what you think of my team. So, yeah, since you've seen my team, I'm gonna go ahead and explain to you how to budget your team properly. So, for your goalkeepers, I would suggest um, go from like 9 to 10 million for your goalkeepers. For your defenders, I would suggest go from 36 to 40 million. And for your forwards, 26 to 31 million. For your forwards, I would, I would pick two premium forwards that are out from 9 to 13 million, combined with one cheaper forward, 6 to 8.5 million. But as you can see, I have Salah. And I was supposed to pick like three premium midfielders from like 7 to 9. 7 to like 12 million but Salah is like 13 million so you know, everybody wants Salah so yeah it, it was hard to, to decide really hard because picking 3 premium midfielders from 8.5 to 11 million and then another diff midfielder but Salah is 13 million so like why not let me get Salah if he scores his price will go up and by then I might not even be able to get him so let me stick, stick, stick with Salah Although my strikers will be like weak, Wilson and Tipoche. But remember this is not my final team and my final team will be coming out just if just on Friday morning like on Twitter, Instagram, a link below I'll show you. My links below on Instagram and Twitter. You can check it out there. Go for defenders. For all defenders you can choose like you can choose two defenders like from five and five to six million and the rest you can put from four to four point five million. I would suggest one is four million, and like Molone is four million. Is it? Yeah, Molone is defender. I'm sure. Yeah, four million, and the rest are four point five million. And keepers, I wouldn't go really big on keepers. I would suggest choose a keeper that's four point five, another one five million, or choose a keeper from six point five to five million, another one for like four million, which is balance out the total. Because really, you want to balance out the. You want to balance out the your money with all the players yeah so 
4.5-5 million for the goalkeepers, two goalkeepers. Or you choose a 5.5-6 million for one keeper and a 4 million for one other keeper. So that's pretty much it, how you can budget your team out. And without further ado, I'll show you my league codes right here, top. You can join my league. There are quite a number of players. They're always ready to invite more people, as many people as possible. There's no ma there's no like maximum uh, limit. You can join the league if you want. That's everything. My league code is there. I've talked about the budget, budgeting about the budgeting for making transfers. I hope I explained it to you properly and and you got an idea of how to do it. And if you don't know about fantasy, just search fantasy Premier League on Google. Go to fantasy Premier League. They have um. If you go to more here, and you go to health, they can help you out, they can show you how to make your team. It's a really fun game. And it's just, the Premier League season is around the corner. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. And that's it for me. Till next time, see you. And make sure you subscribe and, like the, and hit the like button. And all that good shit and comment down below.